Echoes of Destiny In the heart of a sprawling wilderness, surrounded by towering trees and veiled in the cloak of secrecy, there lay a cave, the entrance to a subterranean world filled with mystery and shadows. Ella, an avid adventurer with a fascination for the unknown, found herself drawn to the mouth of the cavern. Aiden, an intrepid soul seeking solace in nature's embrace, followed the same enigmatic pull. The cave, with its yawning mouth and ancient echoes, beckoned them both. Unbeknownst to each other, Della and Aiden ventured into the cool, dimly lit chamber, where the air bore the earthy scent of hidden realms. As they navigated the twists and turns, the cave unveiled its wonders, stalactites hanging like crystal chandeliers and stalagmites rising like silent sentinels. In the heart of the cavern, where shadows seemed to dance to an ethereal melody, Ella and Aiden's paths converged. The flickering light from their shared flashlight revealed wide-eyed glances, an acknowledgement that their individual quests had led them to an unexpected intersection beneath the Earth's surface. The atmosphere inside the cave was a symphony of eerie echoes, each footstep resonating against the ancient walls. Stalactites glistened like crystal daggers overhead, and the uneven ground beneath their feet added an element of unpredictability to their every step. The air was thick with an earthy aroma, a blend of damp soil and the lingering scent of undiscovered secrets. As they explored further, however, the labyrinthine passages became a maze of uncertainty, and the cave secrets wrapped them in a shroud of darkness. Hours passed, and realization dawned, they were lost. The cave, once a sanctuary of curiosity, now became a cocoon of shared vulnerability. Ella and Aiden, bound by the darkness and the shared vulnerability of the unknown, huddled together for warmth and comfort. The chill of the underground world seeped through, making their shared warmth not only a necessity but a lifeline in the abyss. The glow of a solitary flashlight painted their surroundings in transient hues, revealing the contours of the cave walls that held stories untold. Ella and Aiden, their shoulders pressed together, navigated the labyrinth of uncertainty not only with the beam of their flashlight but with the flicker of newfound connection. As the night descended, the cave became an intimate sanctuary, a refuge against the encroaching darkness. Their shared breaths created clouds of warmth in the chilled air, and the silence between them spoke volumes. In the absence of the outside world, Bella and Aiden found solace in each other's presence, their shared vulnerability forging a connection that transcended the boundaries of the cave's confines. The passage of time, marked only by the rhythmic beat of their hearts, became irrelevant in the timeless embrace of the underground world. Ella, with her adventurous spirit, found a calm anchor in Aiden's quiet strength. Aiden, in turn, discovered a kindred spirit in Ella's resilience, a companionship born out of necessity and nurtured by the shared struggle against the unknown. As they huddled together, the walls of the cave seemed to transform into silent witnesses, understanding the unspoken language of their shared experience. Ella and Aiden, with the passage of each moment, found courage in their togetherness, a warmth that defied the physical chill of the cave and blossomed into an emotional sanctuary. In the depths of the cave, where time flowed like an underground river, Ella and Aiden conversed about life beyond the cavern's embrace. Dreams, aspirations, and the fragility of human existence became topics of shared exploration, a vulnerable exchange that echoed in the quiet chambers. With the arrival of dawn, the cave's darkness gradually relinquished its hold. The first rays of sunlight filtered through the cracks and crevices, 
painting the cave in hues of amber and gold. Ella and Aiden, now illuminated by the natural light, realized that the challenges of the night had transformed into an unexpected gift, the gift of connection born out of shared vulnerability and mutual reliance. As they emerged from the cave, blinking in the morning light, Ella and Aiden found themselves on the threshold of a new day. The wilderness outside, once a distant unknown, now seemed to greet them with familiarity. The entrance to the cave, where their paths had converged in the darkness, now marked the exit from a shared journey through the abyss. Hand in hand, Ella and Aiden stepped into the sunlight, carrying with them the echoes of the night spent in the depths of the cave. The wilderness, witness to their unexpected connection, seemed to applaud their emergence, a celebration of resilience, camaraderie, and the transformative power of shared vulnerability. Their emergence marked not only the end of a subterranean odyssey but the beginning of a new chapter. The cave, with its intricate wonders, had become the backdrop for a love story written in the language of shared exploration and mutual discovery. The world outside, a canvas of endless horizons, awaited the imprint of their footsteps, a testament to the enduring bond born from the embrace of the abyss. As Ella and Aiden embraced the sunlight, they carried with them the echoes of the cave's mysteries, their shared journey through the labyrinthine depths a testament to the resilience of love and the transformative power of shared exploration. The wilderness, their newfound playground, echoed with the laughter of two souls intertwined by destiny, a symphony written in the language of love, illuminated by the eternal glow of the cave's hidden wonders. Ella and Aiden, ready to continue their exploration of the wilderness and the vast landscapes that awaited them, an intertwined destiny echoing through the tapestry of time. The End